Justice Ginsburg's death, we've lost another great American champion. Ruth Bader Ginsburg had already made her mark on history before she arrived in Washington, and from there, she continued making an impact on the lives of Americans. Natisha Lance spoke with attorney Brett Williams, who is also a former federal prosecutor in Atlanta, about her life, legacy, and what happens moving forward. I'm joined by former federal prosecutor and current defense attorney Brett Williams. Brett, good to see you. So what is the legal legacy of Justice Ginsburg? What does she leave behind? Well, first, she's a titan and an amazing jurist, was an amazing jurist. And what she leaves behind is a legacy of, of, of being a wonderful Supreme Court justice, an advocate for the rule of law and the rightness of law. I don't know if people know, her nickname among certain people was the notorious RBG. Oh, yeah. Because of her commitment. Yes, absolutely. We That was that did become her affectionate name, nickname. She was also known as a Supreme Court justice who was more liberal. What kind of void will she leave in the court? Well, and people say liberal, uh, it was a, an approach to the law and to justice. And the void she'll leave is, to, is being that vote and that voice and that advocate for that particular set of values, that outlook. And that's one of the things that we lose on the court by losing her as an associate justice is that voice, that advocate, that perspective in the marketplace of ideas. You know, and as we are approaching an election coming up in November, what are your thoughts on what happens next, especially since her, her, her death is so close to that election? Will they reelect someone new or will they wait until afterwards? What are your thoughts? Well, and those are, are two options. And one of the things that's going to be, I think, unfortunate is this may become a football, uh, as many people can remember with the nominee Justice uh, Merrick Garland under Obama, the previous president, uh, that nomination got held up. The Senate wouldn't hold a vote. And ultimately, uh, Gorsuch was nominated uh, and put on the court by the current president after the election, mm -hmm. much to the consternation of the Democrats and possibly delight of Republicans. The question is whether her seat will become that type of political football in this, given it's so close to the election. Well, I suppose only time will tell. She has such a rich legacy that she leaves behind, a staunch fighter for women's rights, an icon for sure, always known as the notorious RBG. Brett Williams, thank you so much for your time. Thank you.